Hey there, Unreal Engine enthusiasts. Welcome to our cozy corner, where today we're diving into the awesome world of procedural level generation. If you've been following along, you're probably already jazzed about what this plugin can do. So let's not waste any time and jump right in. First things first, let's snag the third person demo from Unreal Engine. It's like a shortcut to a cool multiplayer character setup. Open the sample map and let's get our hands dirty with some multiplayer actions. Here's a quick tip. Hit up the three dots menu, flip the net mode to play as listen server, and decide how many players you want to join your game. Oh, and make sure everyone has a player start actor. Now, play in the new editor window and take a peek at your multiplayer characters. All good? Awesome, let's roll. Time to bring in the big guns, a generator from our plugins treasures. If you can't see them, no problemo, just toggle on show plugin content in the settings and you're golden. Pro tip alert. If you're all about that smooth performance, and who isn't. Try to spawn those tiles in the editor. It's like prepping your snacks before the movie starts. Way better than scrambling in the dark when the action's already rolling. But if you're stuck spawning tiles on the fly, no problem. Just hook up the generator at the begin play event of your map and initialize the map. It's like setting the stage before the curtain rises. Now, let's keep our multiplayer vibe chill. Imagine one of your buddies stumbles upon a key. Boom! They've got the power to whip up a map or a slice of it. How cool is that? Jump into the third person character blueprint. Let's say your friend scores the key and hits E to spark some map magic. You can dish out some pre-cooked seeds or go with random numbers. I'm all about that surprise element. Bind that E key, and to make sure our map making mojo runs through the server, create a new event, set it to run on server, and you're halfway there. Next, we must grab a reference to our generator class. You can use get all actors of class with tag, or just get all actors of class. and set it to the generator class. We need a quick check, pick the first generator, and you're set. Before we hit the big red button, let's clear the stage with initialize map in game. And we really want to the clear the stage. Ready for the grand finale? Call the generate map. And let's roll the dice with a random seed. We're crafting the hole, folks. Don't forget the switch has authority node. If player is the server, you're the boss. Go find that generator. If not, ring up the server event we just cooked up. Sweet, let's give it a try. From the client's view, press that E key and watch the result. Both server and client get the same new map. Now, switch to the server side, press E, and a fresh map for everyone to explore. That's a wrap, my friends. Thanks for hanging out. Got questions? Drop in the comments.